could the New York Knicks be in store for another major trade this summer? The stories are coming out. The rumors are swirling. Now, if it is true, if it is not true, most of the time it's just rumors and it's not true. And these reporters just want clicks and yada, yada, yada. But it's summertime, so I think it is only right to react to some of it, not all of it. I thought it was interesting. This is from, I'm going to pull up a story from Ian Begley. S and Y, and who other than Carl Anthony Towns, who has been rumored to be a New York Nick for I want to say about three to four years now. It is, it's like it is not summer Knicks basketball unless Carl Anthony Towns is rumored to be a New York Nick. And it's summertime, and we already have should the New York Knicks trade for Carl Anthony Towns. Now, this story is interesting. A lot of moving pieces within this story. So I'm just going to break down the basics of this story. Here it is. The title, Breaking Down a Potential Knicks Trade for Carl Anthony Towns. Again, this is from Ian Begley. He's breaking down a potential Knicks trade for Minnesota for Carl Anthony Towns. He mentions Bogdanovich. So he says, let's start with Boyan Bogdanovich. His contract is currently guaranteed at $2 million. It becomes fully guaranteed at 19 million on June 28th. If you're thinking about a trade, the Knicks decision on Bogdanovich is key. And then I think he interviewed someone else. I think it makes sense to the Knicks for the Knicks to keep Bogdanovich if the Knicks feel like there is a trade for an all-star on the horizon. Attaching his 19 million with Julius Randle's 28 million dollars allows them to match for just about anyone. If Bogdanovich is gone, this is key. This is very important. If Bogdanovich is gone, they likely need to trade Josh Hart or Mitch Robinson to even or even try to get Precious Achua involved in a sign and trade to get the money to send out. I just want to get down to the basics, the basics of this. Okay, so what packages would work? This is what we want to know. This is what we are here for. What packages? Who is getting sent to Minnesota? Who is getting sent to New York. Here are the packages, and let's, let's, I mean, Randall, Bogdanovich, Gerald Sims, and multiple first round picks would work in a trade that is executed after July 1st. In a trade prior to July 1st, New York could send out Randall and Bogdanovich with the Knicks increasing his partial guarantee next year to 7.8 million and including multiple first round picks. This would be a 100% match for Towns' 36 million. It would hard cap the Knicks at the second apron in 24-25. Why would Minnesota trade Towns? Okay, this, this is we're getting out to the basics. Why would Minnesota trade Towns? Why would the Knicks want Towns? Here we go. The Timberwolves are coming off one of the best seasons in franchise history. They won 56 games. Um, bah, bah, bah. Towns was an integral part of the team's success. Finances, as currently constituted, Minnesota projects to pay $75 million in luxury tax next season. Ouch. Are they willing to spend that money? Trading Carl Anthony Towns can alleviate some of that cash, alleviate some of that money. Why would the Knicks want Towns? Yes. Why in the world would the New York Knicks want Towns, in my opinion? Why would they ship Randall and Bogdanovich and Picks? For Carl Anthony Towns, when Julius Randle is essentially, in my opinion, I think he's better than Carl Anthony Towns. Now, the injury history has, you know, hampered him a bit. Ankle last year, freak injury, shoulder. Don't know how he's going to come off that shoulder surgery. That's a big question mark. Is he going to be the same? That's a big question mark. But he is due an extension, and he wants to get paid. So... Why would the Knicks want Towns? The Knicks will always have a degree of interest in Towns. The NBA, like, like most entities, is a relationship business. Knicks president Leon Rose is Towns' former agent. Basically, they know Towns, and Towns is familiar with Leon Rose. There are plenty of organic connections between the Knicks and Towns as far as his fit in the basketball court. Bah, bah, bah. And then he says, I can't say with any certainty whether the key decision makers still view Towns in that way. But I thought in this article, what I saw which I actually tweeted a graphic of. Um, I think it was in the Bogdanovich. Okay, here it is. This is the key line from Ian Begley. Would the Knicks move any of the other players Gozlan mentions above? Ian Begley says, my read is that any player outside of Brunson would be available in the right trade. And he says, as you'd expect. 
I thought that line was interesting because you're telling me any player would be available in a Carl Anthony Towns trade. You're telling me Dante. You're telling me the Villanova boys. Now I get it. It's the NBA. It's a business. But coming off this amazing season with the chemistry that the Knicks have currently, you're telling me you want to break that up. You want to, you know, in the right trade, let's say Booker's available. Let's say somebody of that caliber is available. You're telling me you want to kind of ruffle the feathers a little bit when we had this great, amazing season. Now, look, if it makes your team better, you got to do it. You got to do it. But I think this summer, if the Knicks were to make such trade, anyone's available besides Brunson. And look, it's, it's a smart thing to say. Like, it's, we're open for business. I mean, no one is untouchable besides Jalen Brunson, obviously, clearly. I thought this Towns, look, t Carl Anthony, in my opinion, do I want Carl Anthony Towns? Is he a good player? Yeah, but him and Randall, I think could fit together you know they could fit well together i don't see trading julius randall back to minnesota but i don't think that would work financially but i just think towns he had his moments in the playoffs he had great games in the playoffs he had bad games in the playoffs but i think the knicks just kind of look at this julius randall extension looming and they're kind of like eh, do we really want to give him that big money we don't know how he's going to react off of his shoulder surgery so I think they're kind of figuring that out. But Towns will always be rumored to be a New York Knick. And look, where there's smoke, there's fire. I've been saying it for many years now. And we'll see. I mean, let me know in the comments below. What do you think? Do you want Towns? Do you like? Do you think Towns is the guy the Knicks should go for? Do you feel like we should trade Randall, Bogdanovich, and picks for Towns? Or do you kind of just want to run it back and, and just tinker the team in little increments, get Randall back in here? Look, I, 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 I think Randall has been rumored. Every summer, Randall's going to be rumored. I think until he proves it in the playoffs, I think Knicks fans every summer are just going to be like, look, there's going to be fans that want to trade him, that want to keep him. I think he needs, to, he needs to have a signature playoff moment to shut everyone up. But, you know, I thought it was interesting, and I thought that line from Begley was interesting. Any player besides Jalen Brunson is available. I was like, hmm, oh, okay. Guys, I mean, Brunson and Hart have a podcast now. And, you know, the chemistry is there between Dante and Dibs. And everyone loves the coach. I, I, I just thought that was that was the interesting line that Ian Begley threw out. But, hey, the goal is to win a championship. The goal is to beat pretty much Boston in the Eastern Conference. They're the best team in the East. You want to strive to beat them. And... Whatever it takes to make your team better. Whatever it takes. But look, this summer is going to be interesting. Mitch Robinson, Randall, trade rumors are swirling. Another Carl Anthony Towns rumor. Do the New York Knicks go this route? I don't know. I don't know. But hey, it's summertime. We're going to have a bunch of these rumors. But hey, I mean, let me know in the comments below. What do you think of that? Do you want Towns? Do you feel like it'll be best for the New York Knicks to pair Towns with Randall? I don't know if you can make that money work without giving up a Julius Randle, but I, I doubt it. Hey, I mean, trading Randle plus picks for Towns, I just, I don't think that's a move where the New York Knicks go. Let me know in the comments below, what do you guys think? And let me know, what do you guys think of that Ian Begley line? Every, any Nick players available besides Jalen Brunson. I'm Anthony from Knicks Nation. Smash the thumbs up button, subscribe to the channel as always. And let's go Knicks. Peace.